Hi everyone, welcome back to One Leaf Tarot Family. How are you all doing? I hope you're all doing well and keeping safe. Thank you so very much to all of my existing and new subscribers out there for all of your love and support. Please know that I appreciate every one of you. And for those that are new to my channel, welcome to my channel. I hope you'll join our beautiful community here as well. Everyone, I have been called to do this reading for you today. And as per the title of the reading, it is a smoke scrying reading. And I did one a few months ago and that one I only had one reading. For this reading, I will be doing two different readings. So, and the first option is And it's your second option. Take all the time you need. And when you are ready, the timestamps will be listed in the description box and the comments box below. I will see you in your reading. Hello, group one. For those that chose this option number one here, welcome to your reading. I will be using a cone incense and I will be reading the smokes that come out of this incense and as well, whatever I'm able to channel, I will let you know. So please clear your mind. Imagine yourself in a beautiful place that is filled with lots of love and light. So just listen. I'm feeling that some of you here are feeling very stressed. You are under financial stress. Others of you, you are missing someone this could be your person i'm also hearing that this this could be someone that you lost recently i'm very sorry about that I heard that others of you have recently lost your job and you are looking for another job. I'm feeling a lot of anxious energies here for some of you so just relax okay relax your mind and for others of you you're feeling lost you don't know what your next steps are going to be I'm hearing that some of you here are trying to get out of a situation mm. Are you trying to leave your, your job? Some of you here don't really like your job. And you have also been trying to look for another job. I just heard no luck so far. Have some of you been in an accident recently? Some type of mishap.
it's not um, very serious, but some type of an accident. I'm hearing that maybe some of you were cooking in a kitchen and you somehow burnt yourself. Or you touch a really hot pan or a pot. Others of you recently have been in a heated argument with someone, I'm hearing a family member. I'm also hearing a friend. and a partner. Um some of you are feeling that why is life not smooth sailing for for you you're feeling that everything is going sideways that's what i heard I'm hearing that there are other options. There are many other options. Things will be better for you in a few months, I heard. Three months. Some of you are feeling that things are going in circles. I'm also hearing that um, others of you, you're repeating the same old behavior pattern. Spirit is asking you to change your routine or change the way you do things. If things have not been going well for you, and this is just for some of you, if things have been going not as smoothly for the past maybe three months or more. Try to do things the opposite way. Meaning, I'm going to give you an example. Every morning, for example, when you leave your house, if you drive, you usually turn right. Try doing the opposite turn left, take a detour for 10 minutes or so, or five minutes, or even up to 15 minutes. So leave your house a little bit earlier. Take a detour for about 15 minutes, and then find your way to wherever you are planning to go, maybe to work. So try to reverse or do things opposite for your routine and things will be reversed for you is what I'm hearing. So things will be better for you. Okay. And this message is only intended for those that things have been have not been going smoothly for the last at least three months. 
And for others of you, if things have been going smoothly, don't change your direction. For others of you, you need to pay attention to your health, I heard. If you haven't been to your doctors for at least a year, please go see your doctor just for a checkup is what I heard. And this is just for some of you, okay? I feel that this, some of you, okay, are feeling very stressed. Like I believe I mentioned this very early on when I started your reading. You guys are feeling very stressed. Go somewhere where, especially when you are unemployed, if you want things to change or your life or luck to come to you I'm hearing that you should go somewhere that there's a lot of people okay or a lot of traffic walk there for about 10 minutes or 15 minutes just absorb the energy of busyness of the crowd you're gonna your your whole energy is going to change you're going to have a replenish of your energy or your energy will replenish and your vibrational level will change as well so and that's when you're going to be able to attract positive flow of energy and things will change for you. It's what I'm hearing. Some of you here are animal lovers, I heard. You have a dog and a and a cat. You should spend more time with your pets. I'm also hearing that you should meditate with them. You're going to feel a lot better after, is what I'm hearing. I just heard that some of you really like noodles or pasta. You love your noodles ramen noodles or some type of pasta for others of you i'm hearing that things are moving up okay things are moving up for you I'm also hearing that a 
if things have not been going well, consider moving, okay, to a different location or cleanse your space for others of you. That's what I'm hearing. Others of you, I just heard that you really like candles or doing some type of magic using fire or candles. Some type of you love candles, okay? That was the message that I heard. And this is just for some of you here. Things are going to be in alignment for others of you. If you're asking whether things are going to, or if you are going to be blessed with some sort of question that you're looking for, the answer is yes. It's what I'm hearing. Don't distrust or don't be in the distrust energy is what I'm hearing. If you believe that the universe is helping you, or if you believe that the higher power is helping you, don't be in the distrust energy is what I'm hearing. So Stay your course. For others of you, you are very busy. You feel that you don't have the time to do everything. I'm hearing that you should ask for help. Ask for help now, it's what I'm hearing. After all, group one, we as humans, we are not meant to operate alone, right? We are social beings, so trust that others will be there for you. Reach out and ask for help is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing that some of you here You tend to do things, you go with the flow. Spirit is asking that maybe it's time for you to step out of that. Express your talent, express your skill set. 
don't go with the flow anymore. You deserve more, is what I'm hearing. Others of you are getting ready to go somewhere, is what I'm hearing. You're getting ready to go out. I heard clean your stove. Your stove is very important, is what I'm hearing. Let's clean your stove. And this is just for some of you. It's a place where it will attract abundance. So always keep that area clean, is what I'm hearing. Are you going to let things slide? And this question is for a small percentage of you watching. I heard, don't let things slide anymore. You have to speak up. Some of you have been playing phone tag with someone here. You've been trying to get a hold of someone or someone's been trying to get a hold of you and you have been playing phone tag is what I'm hearing. Others of you watching, you are very pure souls here, okay? You believe things very quickly is what I'm hearing. Spirit is saying, don't take things at its face value. You should ask around before you make any decision even if you know something really well or you feel that you know the subject matter really well spirit is saying you should still run it by someone that you can trust and get their opinion it's what i'm hearing here Some of you need to drink a lot of water. You are very dehydrated. You need to stay hydrated. That's what I'm hearing for you here. I 
I just heard that for others of you, if you have any habits that you know are no, not good for you, you should consider stopping that habit is what I'm hearing. I heard smoking. I know you've been trying to quit. Some of you have been trying very hard to quit. That's what I'm hearing. You can do this. Some sort of habits that spirit is asking you to perhaps quitting, okay? I heard quitting. You should consider quitting. And this is entirely up to you, okay? Group one. Some of you here are very determined. You, you trust that things are working for you. You trust in divine timing is what I'm hearing. Others of you have seen some of your manifestation. You have reaped some type of reward is what I'm hearing. Okay, group one, thank you so very much. That was all I had for you. Thank you for letting me do your reading today. Wherever you are, please take very good care of yourself and stay safe. If you feel like doing so, consider subscribing, like, and share, as well as comment if any of the messages resonated. I will see you in my next reading, Group 1. Bye-bye. Hello, Group 2. For those that chose option number 2 here, welcome to your reading. I will be using a cone incense and i'll be reading um, the smokes that come out of it i will let you know and also whatever messages that i'm able to channel i will also let you know so group two please clear your mind imagine yourself in a beautiful place that is filled with lots of love and light. And just listen. Some of you here are feeling a little bit shaky or some sort of instability I'm, I'm feeling for some of you here. You're feeling very unstable.
come back to the center of group two. It's what I'm seeing for you here. You are, and this is just for some of you, you your thoughts are all over the place. You need to come back to the center. Ground yourself is what I'm hearing. You need to do some grounding. Your root chakra. You need to work on your root chakra is what I'm hearing. And this is just for some of you. Do some grounding meditation. Perhaps walk in nature. And if you're able to do some gardening, do that too is what I'm hearing. For others of you, things have been very, very busy. Okay, I heard that. I heard that some of you are feeling like you're drowning. Metaphorically speaking, there's too much going on is what I'm hearing. Lighten your load. Group two for some of you here, okay? Others of you, I'm hearing that you are still holding on to your past. And even though you are no longer with this person, you are still trying to hold on to the memories is what I'm hearing. Time to move forward is what I'm hearing. Your life is never going to be the same is what I'm hearing. But it doesn't mean that you can't move forward. You're completing this tough cycle. I heard that some of you here have been checking your bank account recently and you're really worried about your financial situation. Some of you here are very intuitive. I'm even hearing that you're connecting. You're doing a lot of connecting works. You're doing, some of you have been able to connect with your higher self 
I'm even hearing you've been communicating a lot with spirit. You've been doing a lot of soul searching is what I'm hearing here. Wow. Others of you, I'm seeing that you have this really, you have this invisible shield that you're trying to shield around you. You are protecting your energy and your space because of past experience. It's what I'm seeing here. You're not letting anyone in. Which is understandable, right? Spirit is saying, you should try to I heard the word emerge, come out, come out and see the light. It's what I'm hearing. You're going to be okay. You are protected. You are so protected. It's what I'm hearing. You had no idea how protected you are, is what I'm hearing. Even if you fall, spirit will make sure that you're going to be able to pick yourself back up. Those are the lessons, okay? And this is just for some of you. It could be karmic, is also what I'm hearing. But know that they are watching you, okay? The universe has been watching you. They have been making notes. Even if you feel like you're not being shielded okay and now you're 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 shielding yourself thinking that no one can help you except for yourself is what i'm hearing no it's not true it's what i'm hearing you are the the universe has been making notes you are meant to go through some of the lessons here but you're definitely going to come out okay and this is just for some of you. It's this very strong message. You need to come out now. It's what I'm hearing. Have you been looking at the stars or the skies a lot lately for others of you is what I'm hearing. For others of you, I heard the word unbreakable. No matter what life throws you at, you are unbreakable. Know that, claim that. It's what I'm hearing. Very strong, powerful group. I'm feeling your energy. I'm feeling that something is going to burst. Um, I'm feeling that some new, some type of 
message you're going to be receiving. And this is just for some of you here. Some type of, I'm hearing a breath of fresh air. You're going to be like, you're going to sigh so hard. And you're going to say, finally, it's here. It's what I'm hearing for you. For others of you, I'm I'm hearing that you're trying to switch. I heard the word switch. Are you trying to switch job? You're trying to switch something, switch something with someone. Are you trying to switch off something? It's also what I'm getting. You are trying to switch something. You're planning on trying something new? For others of you, I feel like you're always being interrupted, okay? There's always something that comes up. You can never stay focused when you want to. It's what I'm hearing. There's always interruption. Some of you here really like to dance and you really enjoy music is also what I'm hearing. Dancing release a lot of stress for you is, is what I'm hearing as well as music. For others of you, I'm hearing that even though you are with a lot of people or there's a lot of people around you, but you're still feeling very lonely. You're not feeling fulfilled is what I'm hearing. Perhaps is time to move forward or it's time for a change. Others of you, I'm um, hearing that you like to tie up your hair. You like to do something on your hair. You don't like it when hair is, your hair is I'm hearing that you like to pull your hair back. You don't like it when hair is on your face. It's what I'm seeing here okay um others of you you're going to receive some type of news but this news is gonna creep up on you like you're not going to expect this news and 
this news is gonna make you smile. You're going to, it's not, it's not a big news, but it's like little news. Like this news is gonna come, it's like an ex unexpected surprise. And you're going to be smiling, okay? I'm hearing that it's not too late to change. Whatever situation that you're in right now, it's not too late to change it if you're not happy. Okay? Every one of you is different, right? So, for example, if you don't like your current job, it's not too late to change. Okay? Don't feel that it's too late. It's what I'm hearing here. I'm also hearing that others of you, you have been listening to others a lot. You have been ignoring your soul, what your soul or your purpose is. I'm hearing spirit is saying you should listen to yourself now. It's time for you to do what you want, not what others want, is what I'm hearing. Because you are worth it, group two. Wow. You have such beautiful inner sparks, group two. You have no idea the magic in you. You have so much to offer. You have such beautiful energy. Thank you for coming to this reading. You're going to do well in life, group two. This is a message for some of you here. If you want, if you always wanted to do something, even as small as wearing that dress or wearing those pair of shoes or having that hairdo, do it. Go ahead. Don't be afraid. Because you're such beautiful souls, wow. Your energy is so beautiful. So graceful, group two. Share your gift if you want to start that business or that if you want to write that song or if you want to sing do it is what I'm hearing if you want to take that trip do it okay whatever that you have been always wanting to do Come out, do it, is what I'm hearing. Age does not matter, okay? That's what I'm hearing.
I'm hearing that some of you here need to clean your closet. You can donate anything, okay? Group two, except for shoes, okay? Even if they are so new and you have only worn them for maybe a couple days or a couple times, don't donate your shoes. You need to throw them out, okay? It's what I'm hearing here. Never donate your shoes or never give anyone your shoes. Okay, even if it's a friend. I'm also hearing that don't give anyone wallets, okay, as a gift. It's also what I'm hearing. If if this person is your family member, it's okay, but if this person is not your family member, never gift someone wallets as gifts, okay? Because you're giving away your fortune or your wealth is what I'm hearing. Okay. Group two, thank you so very much for joining me today, for letting me do your reading. I hope you enjoyed it. Wherever you are, please take very good care of yourself and stay safe. Feel free to share, subscribe, and like, as well as comments if any of the messages resonated. Okay, I will see you in my next reading. Bye-bye.